Hello, everybody. Welcome back. More for the king. I'm joined with Orbital Potato and Rhapsody. Hell yeah. You're We're joined sorry. with Orbital You're joined Potato with? and Rhapsody. Joined with. Yeah. We have been conjoined. To, I have been conjoined to Orbital Potato and Rhapsody oh, in a damn. groundbreaking new surgery. Oh, my goodness. I'm sorry to hear it, bud. I'm excited about the opportunities that we have to work on like constant collaborations together. <laughs> See, I'm yeah. I'm I'm pleased to hear that. I like the I positivity. Think we make a, I think we should make a documentary series. I mean, there is no other Let's Play channel of people conjoined in that way. I mean, we have the, the whole market, however big it may. Oh, hello, man. Should oh, I? What? How does that not call Rhapsody in? That's yeah. nonsense. That's why I'm confused. Is it because there's like a, the tree is blocking it? No, it's because it's a swamp, so the the pull-in range is shorter. Oh, uh, okay. Are there, are there conjoined triplets? Is that a thing that exists? I don't. Uh, uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna rather grimly venture the fact that it's kind of biologically difficult for them to exist past the point of birth because the complex uh, systems that are that's... required to maintain a, a life i i know but what's like, everybody's favorite like baby thing. animal oh uh, <laughs> also puppy. should we go in this, this puppy should we just go into this it, one just it. yeah just, so just fight it yeah, just fight it. yeah just... we can win <laughs> I'm, I'm well known as a, a very big dog fan in multiple ways i am a very big person and i am also a dog fan I am a very large fan of dogs, and I also like particularly large dogs. Triple meaning for very big dog fan. <laughs> Sorry, you're a big dog fam? Is that what you said? I didn't actually catch I am a big dog said. fam. I'm a big dog fan fam. Yeah. I'm a big fan fam. I'm a big dog fam fan fam favorite. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> I I'm indeed a fan of fans. Oh, 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 give me, give me, Rito. Can you give me Rhapsody's? Can you get Rhapsody's money and then give it to me so I can gamble it away in the night mark, in the dark carnival even? Oh, I need a ticket. We don't have a ticket. Yeah, you need a ticket. I'm pretty oh. certain. I'm only gonna buy a ticket. Uh. I want to buy a ticket then. I haven't seen a ticket yet for sale. Uh. I would have gotten one for you because you do have a ridiculous amount of luck, and I would have thought that would be hilarious fun. Um. So y'all, I'm probably just gonna like teleport to the boat and then call y'all on the boat. <laughs> so we don't have to spend 50 the... moves. Yeah, it can pull from anywhere yeah, in the biome. Please do that. That would be honestly a great thing to do. Okay, no, I just straight up doesn't want to do that. So see you later. <laughs> can you see the chaos? The chaos henchman camp. Does that allow you to call everyone in? I mean, is there any no, other? No, that's, that's standard range as well. Uh, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, what can I get done? I could probably go fight that ancient quarry by myself. We'll do it then. Uh, really? I mean, it's level four. I'm level six. I mean, how are we going to get out of here if we don't have poison destroying boots? I mean, we could just get poisoned. Uh, uh, I'd rather not get poisoned. I'd rather not too, but... <laughs> would it... I guess yeah, like sorry, you're I... not wrong. I should probably come up and help. I, I do have a, a portal scroll too, but... <laughs> I mean... Uh, Alright, Rhapsody's got like 15 portal scrolls, I think, doesn't he? No, I just used my final one there. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Well... Thing is, you guys are gonna move up to that space in the next turn. Uh, so unless I engage and then go through this scan, yeah, it's fine. Oh Aww. no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh wow! I actually can't even sneak. Just take, just fight him. Just Honestly, him. he's a scamp. The Welcome problem is, the scamp is invasive. Royal Rumble. <laughs> Rhapsody versus Ooh. Scam in the red corner, weighing in at probably zero pounds, considering it's just a collection of ones and in a Rhapsody. 
Put your heart into it. <laughs> <laughs> that was that was impressive. I will. I'll grant you that. Thank My, you very much. My uh, throat hurts uh, just listening to it. Yeah, me too, actually. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's actually uh, that's actually something I have heard before in a specific instance of singing Louis Armstrong what? songs at uh, karaoke. Uh, you poisoned yourself? What? Oh yeah, I changed my boots. Okay, <gasps> yeah, I'm poisoned now. Whatever. Uh, I did okay. this for you. He came all the way up here just so you wouldn't get poisoned. Yeah. Don't say you never to did poison myself for you. so that none of y'all. Uh, we're gonna fight this blue jelly, by the way, Rhapsody. That sounds like a grand old idea, my dude. <laughs> you need to do the you need to do the WrestleMania a intro, Rito. <laughs> Sorry, in Rito. Oh, okay. Oh, Rito, you can't like you can't Let's do it if you're in the trunks. You know. Let's get rumble. <laughs> there. <laughs> my my throat hurts way too bad. For, like I said from from listening, I actually start to start to feel something in my throat. I was like. <laughs> Just a, a terror <laughs> reflex. Oh, I'm sorry. Terror <laughs> reflex. <laughs> it's like acid reflex, but with terror. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like my deepest insecurities and fears bubbled up from my my stomach. Uh -oh, the feeling. I, I don't begrudge you for that at all. Thank you. All right. You know that's the cure. That's the cure for terror reflex. Is a good friend that supports you. Kindness. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Absolutely. Kindness. Um, I can't do much unless I teleport around. Is it okay. worth it to even teleport anywhere? I I got two. No, it's not. I so you should move yeah. two and then don't end your turn. Orbital, if you can pass your dancing nettle down to Rito, uh, then Rito can pop that and move a bunch of spaces up to engage us in the Bone Mage, and then I can move a bunch of spaces up the turn after to engage us in the Sea Hag camp and start going downwards. I will have there to go. pop another focus to get there. Is it worth it since we already did no, that? No, you, you don't need to do that. You can just get there. Like, you can just walk towards it. It's fine. Yeah. I hate swamps. I just, just end general. my turn then? Mm hmm Okay, okay. I thought you wanted... I see, I see. No, it's all good. I, love, I do love how this game is that, you know, Rhapsody is the one that's playing. And we're just like... <laughs> we're just like doing what Rhapsody tells us to do. Kind of, but you know, it works best that way, so it's fine. Oh, I'm not uh, even here. I'm missing out on this one. Yeah. Rough. Rough. Excuse you? I was going to say, that's, uh, you were imitating one of your your, your puppers. Your, your, uh, your number one favorite your... uh, baby animal. Exactly. Run big. Speaking of, we only heard what, what Rhapsody's favorite animal was. Yeah, Rita, exactly. What's your favorite animal? Oh my god, baby fruit bats. My dude. Baby Some fruit bats. Fruit my bat. dude, do yourself a favor. No, 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 no. I have Google seen images. baby fruit bats in real life. Everyone. Uh, we have them all around here. And and you care not for them? Not particularly, no. Hmm. I mean, like, they're okay, sure, but it's, it's no popper. Also, baby raccoons. Also baby kittens. Also baby squirrels. Wait, red or gray squirrels? We already had this conversation. <laughs> I, I'm willing to have this conversation a hundred more times until you accept the, the one gray that squirrels won't make you angry on this planet. <laughs> the one that will not upset you. Red squirrels, then. Good. Sure. Lovely red squirrels. I love the red squirrels. They're my favorite yeah. shade of squirrel. <laughs> wow. <laughs> you got a favorite shade of squirrel? That's pretty uh, slippery <laughs> slope, man. I'm telling you. I, uh, they are they are cute. <laughs> I strongly disagree. Oh my goodness. What with squirrels? squirrels. About squirrels being cute. Yeah. What is happening? I I actually don't necessarily disagree. Do you think anything is cute but a dog? Anything? Uh not really. <laughs> kinda just kinda just into dogs personally. You need to like wipe Branch your out. Today. Yeah. Oh, I had Broader Horizons, and then I recognized that dogs are the one true pet. Why are you thinking about cuteness in terms of pets? Ask not what you, your dog can do for you. Ask what you can do for your dog. And I will do everything for my dog, yeah. Okay, let me rephrase that <laughs> in the entirely opposite direction. Okay. 
Ask not what you can do for your dog, but what your dog can do for you. Yeah, like companionship, love, just like a furry buddy to like what hang if, out with. Here's a question, right? What if it doesn't actually love you? <laughs> Like, I don't mean to be like, I mean, like, okay. Oh, you know that this is the only thing I'm ever going to worry about from now on? Yeah, yeah, that's just, you can't put that on a man. What if it, what if it can't express any it's, other emotion? Is this worth pop? I mean, we're all, I just, I, nah, it's I, fine. It's I'll just, pull this we're to the all next round. buddy, buddy talking about puppies. Let's just, we had my turn. Yeah. I, like, I'll be, I'll be honest. I've never had a dog. I'm never gonna get All one. Alright, never get one. You don't seem well equipped. I'm not, oh I'm my not ever goodness. gonna get one. I don't want one. The hostility but. is flying all of a sudden. It was just Christmas. You're telling me dogs are not gonna love me? I'm, I didn't say oh, this. I'm good with dogs. I got my dog. every dog on I'm actually, earth allergic, I'm actually allergic to them. I'm actually deadly allergic to them. You're allergic to dogs? <laughs> well, yeah, to looking after them, yeah. Right, yeah. I, <laughs> I figured that was probably gonna be... <laughs> yeah. yeah yeah and just responsibility in general for the most part <laughs> just <Man. laughs> just this is the general rule of thumb. Ugh, why Here. life drain Ugh. well because it's a vampire bat <laughs> yeah but like you know vampires don't have to drink blood do they not they, <laughs> I, I thought the general principle behind most vampire stories is that they do have to drink blood. Yeah, you don't, you don't have to. I don't think they have to. I think that's just a, a like a guideline. It's a myth they tell themselves. They can do whatever they want to do. They, if they put exactly. their vampire Strong, minds to it. Exactly. exactly. Strong will beats strong urges. Strong-willed vampires don't it's, need to drink it's, blood. It's my indie band. Strong-willed vampires. <laughs> <laughs> that, that's, 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 that's not a bad name for an indie band. It. All right, you're going to have to give me exactly the genre of the band, though. Not just indie. Like, what are they? Shoegaze? They could be shoegaze. They could totally be shoegaze. Ex sorry, you're going to have to explain. Shoegaze? What the heck is a shoegaze? Like, the okay, kind of music of all, that you would listen to and gaze at your shoes. <laughs> I'm not even kidding. Literally the definition. <laughs> yeah, yeah. No, no, I don't buy that sarcasm. Give me the actual answer. No, it is. I that believe is it. I believe it 100. I don't, I don't believe it. I don't believe it 0%. I believe it. 0%. All right. I'm going to literally just look up like the genre definition. Are you? You shouldn't do no, that. That's a I'm level six cam. That. We need everyone. Subgenre of Indian alternative rock that emerged in so, the United Kingdom. It, I mean, I guess I, that doesn't say the actual. Okay. So it exists. It's shoegaze. a thing. Also sing known as Dream Pop. Okay. Song. I know it is Dream Pop. Sing me uh -huh. a shoegaze song then. You don't really sing shoegaze. Knees in my shoes. Sorry, did you just say bees in there my they shoes? Go. <laughs> I did not, not quite, but. Okay. I said these are my it. these are my shoes. Oh, okay. They look so blue. <laughs> <laughs> the shoegaze cover of blue suede shoes. <laughs> Let me let me open the curtains to everybody's personal life here. What does everyone's uh, hmm. shoes look like? I feel like nobody knows what what shoes their favorite YouTubers wear. I, I know this is riveting <laughs> commentary too, but <laughs> <laughs> but what what does everyone's shoe what does everyone's shoes look like? Yeah. I think this is actually a good point. I think it is actually quite insightful. I, however, want to hear Orbital's answer first. Okay, my okay. Is First it my of turn? All, oh my god! What? I'm sorry. Yeah, yeah. What do I do? What do I do? What do I do? Came, what do we just came for the gameplay. Stayed for the shoes. Came mm. for the gameplay. Stayed for the shoes. Certainly didn't stay for the gameplay. That's for sure. <laughs> um, okay. First of all, you know the. Okay, so there's this general sort of like, I guess it's just like a general, uh, a general idiom which I think Rhapsody is referring to about, uh, you know, like a, you know, like the shoes are or can be a. A really good indicator of uh, the sort of type of person, or yeah. whatever, or you know, like a window to into your soul, basically. Mm -hmm. You know how you how you conduct yourself. You know, you got shiny shoes, run down shoes, what type of shoes you wear, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Um, I'm not really sure that I buy into that 
as much as like I, I don't think it's like okay, a... So well, what you're saying, I think your shoot choice would, would tell us the same thing that you're telling us now, which is to say you don't even know. I think it's more that he has an embarrassing shoe choice <laughs> and is trying to preface this with uh, this so that to save himself. He I think that Uggs. Alder wears clown shoes. He rocks Uggs all day. Crocs, dude. It's fair. It's fair. It's fair. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Crocs actually? No, of course, of course I'm kidding. I don't wear Crocs. I, I, don't, I can't wear Crocs. I, I feel like if you told me Crocs and you like own and you like were proud of it, I would, I would love that. I would just love that. <laughs> you know, that says okay. more than, more Orville. than just yes. your Sorry, shoes. Orville. Rita, it's probably taunt time. Taunt time. Yep. Everyone else is missing a bunch of HP. This yeah. um. I feel that this discussion requires a little bit more qualification. You know? <laughs> so it's just kind of like... I thought it was I, a simple dumb like question. an MBA to discuss this? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. PhD? PhD in shoes. Uh-huh. Anyway. Orbital, so, what shoes do you wear? I don't think... Okay. Like, this requires a lot more explanation. I don't Why? think... I don't think... I don't think that the shoes are a window into anyone's soul. I think that that's nonsense, and I think that that's superficial. What shoes do you wear? Well, I wear different shoes for different occasions. What shoes <laughs> do you wear? I didn't realize this was gonna be the hardest question I've ever well, asked. Okay, here, okay. How many shoes do you regularly wear? That's my question. I think that's important. That okay. is important. Des describe, describe the types of shoes that you regularly wear. Orbital! What shoes do you wear? <laughs> Ones that go on my feet. Like, what do you want me to say? I can't describe what? the different sorts of shoes that I wear in any in any other way other than that. <laughs> this, is I, a, this is a discussion. I'm I've never been more angry. <laughs> <laughs> Why what color this? are your shoes? Why is it? Well, they're different colors for different shoes, isn't it? What? Uh, start describing. Give me one. Give me one. Well, Give which, me your favorite. Okay, so What's I wear your trainers. I wear trainers. They're quite comfy. All right. What color We're are they? We're getting close up. More? Um, they are, I think they're, they're Adidas. They're blue. And they've got <laughs> white bits on them. <laughs> I like the um, idea that immediately after that you go, yeah, they're Air Jordans from 2004. I got the, uh, you know, the Misfit <laughs> version that came out originally. Uh, cost yeah, thousand dollars on the resale market. Yeah, I'm a, I'm a sneakerhead. I, uh, I get <laughs> That's why it was such a such a deep question to him is because he's a sneakerhead. Yeah. <laughs> like, he like has a closet and just with a hundred different pairs. Which that's why he's asking which ones. <laughs> I appreciate exactly. that. You know what? Are you exactly. talking about the ones but, from my summer closet or my spring closet? <laughs> <laughs> this right. is, I feel that I feel that this is a very serious question. Anyway, so yes. Apparently. So, okay, let's let's talk like serious about this. Primarily, three types of shoes. And well, two types of shoes, but three if you include a slipper. Right? Okay. True. Because I would I would say that a sure. slipper is in effect an honorary shoe. I don't know what you guys think. It's an honorary, it's an honorary shoe. shoe. Yeah. I agree. It's as good as a shoe, right? I mean, you wear it on your feet. It's shoe adjacent. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. Shoe adjacent. Sejacent, as I call it. Um, <laughs> it's a leisure, sh leisure shoe. Yeah. Sejacent. Um, sejacent. Anyway. Sejacent. Yeah. Sejacent. Um, okay. So anyway, I've got like, I've got a, I've got a, a, a smart pair of shoes, which I wear for work. Mm -hmm. I've got a pair of trainers, which I've already described, which are Adidas blue trainers, which I wear in every condition that is not work. Uh, can I attack this guy? No. Uh, oh. That's if I leave... A challenge. It, no. You see, if I leave this, is it going to go down? No, it'll stay. That is for my biceps. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah, and then I wear a slipper. Every other time that I'm not wearing the. See the, how easy that was? Trainer. You didn't need to take the whole episode to answer <laughs> that. 
I've got spiffy shoes for work. I've got trainers I wear outside of them. I've got slippers. All right, Rito, what shoes do you wear? That is way too personal of a question. I can't believe you'd ask me. <laughs> <laughs> I wear like a like a blue athletic type Nike shoe with red and white. It's got it's very much in line. It has all the colors that are in my YouTube logo. In a very yeah, I was actually thinking about <laughs> it's that. got the, I looked across the Discord window just to check. Yeah, the the blue is the exact like almost the exact color of the glasses on my my character, and the the red little line is the same color as my sweatshirt, and then the rest is white. The little the little extra accents. All but right. the, but I'm I'm. You had to pull it out of me. I, I'm sorry. I, that, that's a very personal question. Should I fight this frost uh, crane? Wait, Can we handle it? The only, sorry, is that the only type? Sorry, <laughs> just, sorry. No, do talk about the game first. That's probably quite an important. Should I thing. should I get into this fight with a frost crane? No. No. Okay. I think we could. I think we can. I think we can. I mean, yeah, you can if you'd like. Yeah, go for it. Let's do it. Against the first the first choice. Let's go for it. Tell, yeah, go go for it. Ask me. Oh, oh my God, he's very scary. Why did we do this? Yeah, a little bit scary. Why did nobody tell us this was a bad idea? Uh, I don't know why. Uh, yeah, a little bit scary. Someone ought to. Anyhow, uh, yeah. Well, it took us a really long time to get that out of you, Rito. But I really appreciate you sharing <laughs> personal you guys are just uh, the worst, tale. Honestly. Oh God. Okay, is that the only pair of shoes that you wear? That is. Uh, yeah, actually, right now, yes. Normally, I have like two pairs, but right now, that's the only one. Usually, I get them from the thrift store, and the last one I got from the thrift store was seven bucks, and it lasted like two years. How long do your oh, guys' yeah. shoes last? Uh, probably like a year, year and a half, maybe. Uh, Run mine through the ringer. <laughs> or, or the, which hand? pair? <laughs> which pair of my shoes? Which. I mean, I guess the slippers would probably last well, quite a bit longer. I, I, I don't have shoe, a single right? pair of shoes. I, I don't own a single pair of shoes. In fact, okay, let me rephrase that. I don't think <laughs> I've bought a single pair of shoes in the last three years. I mean, Two or three years. I guess if you have them for different uses, it makes sense that they would last longer. How is it that I just, I cannot... Okay, Rito, you're just carrying me, honestly. I wasn't going to say anything. Well, <laughs> you did. Ooh. Nice dodge. So what shoes do I wear? Thanks use. for asking. Um, no, 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 no. We don't care. No? Okay. Yeah. Sorry. No, I, please do tell us. I'm actually very interested. No. No, what kind of shoes you do you think, wear? You think that a, the shoe is a window oh, into the soul. Oh, thank you for asking, no Frida. Um, so I've got three different pairs in rotation at the moment. Uh, I, I have my kind of like uh, standard black leather... You, you kind of like standard uh, laceless as well, uh, a fair for like dressing up. Uh, and I've also got two pairs of Chuck Taylor All Stars. I wear black and red. Ooh, what's a Chuck Taylor All Star? Are you a kidding Chuck me? Chuck Taylor All Star? You? How? How? I, th how? I, I, I can understand, but I, but I, as a sneakerhead, I can't believe you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, sorry, sorry, yeah. <laughs> as far as like, it's like your your your. Uh, Aircraft question. As far as shoes go, it's like the, the whatever you said of shoes. I understand I what a what a what a Nike is. <laughs> They're uh, iconic. You, you would, would know recognize if you saw them. Sold them. They're like a canvas shoe, kind of flat bottom. Uh, they've typically got like a white trim around them and white laces. They've got a star on them usually. Yeah. Mm. And uh, and yeah, no, I've been wearing uh, Chuck Taylors. I want to say like 10 years almost exclusively. Just chucks and uh, dress up shoes. I, chucks. Also, I really like the chucks because they're like super casual and you can use them to dress down other, uh, outfits that otherwise would be too dressy for the occasion. Like you can wear a tie and you can offset it with Chuck Taylors and like find a reasonable uh, medium to be in. It, sure, it will definitely look like you're a host from the 90s on an MTV program, but still works out i mean i i feel like i learned I, a lot from your shoe choice I, yeah i right I, that's why i thought it was a really insightful question i think i also learned a lot from yours i didn't think orbital's answer was full of all which make me learn a lot too not a lot of good stuff but <laughs>
I'm kidding. It, it awesome. shows that, he... that I don't like Orbital. I mean, it's just <laughs> yeah. it, it shows that he deeply cares about answering the question correctly, despite how upset it will make everyone I, asking. I think it's it's less about ask. It's less about answering the question correctly, and more just like defining what the question actually is. I think that's what I'm all about. You need to make sure that you really get to the nub of the problem. You know. Mm-hmm. <laughs> You're not wrong, it's not I guess. The problem being you in this scenario. <laughs> <laughs> wow. I I appreciate your shoe choice, and and I appreciate you disclosing such a private matter as well. Thank you. I <laughs> I appreciate your appreciation. Very very Aww. nice of you. Oh, Whoa. Can you finish him off, Rhapsody? Oh! What? No. Didn't matter. <laughs> Didn't matter. Didn't oh, matter. Perfect. It's all right. I'll get him. Thank you for finishing that one off. Uh, anytime. Anytime. Speaking of finishing off, oh, like to make us out. Ooh, two body evasion. Probably not better than what currently wearing though. Um, would you like to take us out of the episode, there, Rita? I can do that. Thank you, everybody, for watching. It's been for the king. Check out links for everything in all the descriptions of all of the videos. To go to all of the places of the people that are talking to each other in this video. Comment your shoes in my video mm -hmm. and in maybe the others if they if they want that too. Goodbye. Hell yeah. Catch you around. Bye.